to Crafty Purple Dragon Channel. I've got an unboxing today. Um, this came on the 15th of March. <coughs> I don't know what it is. I do have a couple of things on order still. Um, I'm not sure which it is. So we'll find out together in a box. Fashion DIY Diamond Paint Box says Diamond Painting Fashion DIY Diamond Paint and it's got the steps on there uh, Okay, it doesn't look to have incurred much wrath of the mail system. It's a little bit dented here. Um, here maybe. Not too bad. This ends open, so I'll open this side. See what's coming out. Okay, so the... Uh, it's obviously not on a roller because it's taken on the sh inside shape of the box. It's all squarified. Okay, so that's the box empty. Dispose of that. Um, let's empty out what's inside the painting. Give the painting a minute to rest outside the box. Okay, so we've got a toolkit, some tweezers, wax, a little white boat, which looks smaller than the other ones I've seen. There's a clear pen uh, with a, looks like a 12 placer, maybe, on the end. So that's the toolkit, and these are the drills. I've got an inventory. Uh, okay, I can see which one it is now. So let me find it in my book. Uh, where is it? Do -do -do. Have I actually printed out the picture? I think I've got a couple in here that haven't printed the picture. I hope it's not one of them. Oh no, it's here. Oh, okay. So, it's that one. Um, it's a flower. This bird. I don't know if you can see, there's like a hummingbird. Um, another little bird there. Um, and I thought it was really nice. Uh, yeah. Two hummingbirds and a flower. So there's a green hummingbird there and a yellow and red hummingbird there. And this wa this is from Victoria's Moon. I'll put a link in the description. Um, as usual to the um, to the listing to the website um, about two was about one um, so Victoria's moon 1999 it cost it must have been free postage because I haven't written down the postage cost. It was ordered on the 2nd of March. I'm not sure when it was sent and it was delivered on the 15th of March. So that's less than two weeks altogether. Um, it's a 40 by 50 full. I'm not sure whether it's round or square. Yeah, square. Um... So, while the canvas is still sort of relaxing itself, 
let's have a look at the drills uh, just pull that over there to Okay, so let's have a look. Oh, we've got some bags in here hidden in the folds. That's good because I'm running out of that size for my uh, drill storage. <laughs> Thank you, Victoria's Moon. Hey, there's quite a few. I mean, they're not the most brilliant quality, but there's quite a few of them. So that's that's good. I mean, if you use these little baggies for anything, uh, like I've started to do, um, you know, it's handy to get replenishment of your stocks. If you don't use them, it's annoying to get a load because it's just a load of things that more things that you can't use, I guess. Um, okay, so inventory. Oops, inventory sheet. Which is always handy. Uh, I need my glasses, don't I? Sure, I like these. I like this style of inventory sheet where it gives you, um, if you can see here on the inventory sheet, we've got this, the canvas symbol, we've got the DMC number, we've got how many bags. And we've got the total number of drills that you need in order to complete that picture for each colour. I really like that, um, that they give you both of those pieces of information because some people like to look at the total number of drills and some people like to know how many bags they're going to get. So regardless as to which type of person you are, you've got both the pieces of information there. So that's really good. Um, oh, the more I look at it, the more I love this picture. I love it, I love it. Right, let's have a look at the drills then. Please don't have any bags bursting on me. I don't like it when there's bursting bags. Really annoying. <coughs> right, glasses time. Okay. So, uh, I suppose we can do the ones, the ones where there's only one of them first, because they seem to be out. <laughs> and I'll speed this up as usual for you guys, so you don't have to put up with it. Uh, 3.50, one bag. Uh, uh. Sorry, my battery's gone in my camera, so I'm going to try and finish this in four minutes because that's the amount of space I've got on my phone camera. So, um, otherwise we're going to be in trouble and I'm going to have to hold it. Uh, right, this is 208. And there's one, two, three, four, five... Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, two, oh, eight, eleven.
Sorry, the video cut me off. Give me a minute. I've freed up a bit more space, so... <laughs> um, at least to finish off with the drills, and then I'll wait until my batteries are charged on my... Um, on my other camera to do the... Um, canvas, sorry. Um, uh. Yeah, so um, I've got one quite a lot with just one and most of them you know i've got a good amount of extras for the 200 that are in the packet apart from uh this one 498 where i've only got nine extra beads um and i'll have to be careful with that because i do tend to shed them I end up with loads on my carpet, unfortunately. It'll end up in the vac. Um, or, you know, for the for trash. I don't have a lot. If there's if there's quite a lot of trash in that colour, I'm I might end up not having much in the way of spares. Um okay, so that's the inventory and I'll do the canvas once my batteries have charged on my other camera. Back in a minute. Hi, welcome back. Um, it's now the following day. Um, I've been busy. Uh, well, it's the following evening, actually. Um, the batteries were charged uh, by the time I got up this morning, but I just haven't had time to come and finish off the video. So, uh, I shall do it now. Um, so this is the, I showed you the picture in the book, that's the um, thumbnail. So this is the canvas. Uh, I don't think I told you yesterday, did I tell you yesterday how much it was? I can't remember. Let me find it in my book again. Uh, where is it? Um. Hmm. Oh, okay, yeah, right. So this was from Victoria's Moon. For you, it's like two minutes ago, probably, when I told you this, but for me, it was... 24 hours ago, so <laughs> I just need to refresh my memory. Victoria's Moon, 1999. It's a 40 by 50. Okay, I went quite big with this one. It's a full square, 36 colours. Ordered on the 2nd of March, delivered on the 15th of March. So, let's have a look. Uh... and not rip the paper because I seem to have done that a few times lately so it's stuck on there yuck okay so let's see what this canvas is like Looking good so far. Oh. Now, there's some creases there, but the glue is stuck down. Um, oh, the glue's popped up there, but it isn't like... It's me knocking on the table. Pixie, look. It's me doing that, you dafty. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to get you upset. Good girl. Good girl. You can go and lie down again. I'm sorry. It was my fault. Um. 
yeah I know I think that's okay um, so there are some creases and some rivers but um, I don't think it's anything major because uh, that should all just stick down and the glue should stay stuck down so I'm just going to rub it a little bit try and make sure the adhesive's properly stuck on the canvas and then we'll pick it up again uh, I've got some bubbles now probably from when I opened it right let's have another look yeah that's fine now um, this will go under my mattress to flatten it out just because it's taken on the shape of the box basically uh, I mean it's not too bad but my, my bed is very good at flattening these canvases it's a divan um, so the base is nice and flat and then uh, the mattress is like a memory foam um, latex combo thing um, so it doesn't have any springs or anything that can go through and um, upset the upset the painting um, the back of the canvas looks okay open this end and I'll show you the drill field there is a bit of muck I noticed stuck around the edges can't see it but I don't know it's like bits of grass or something uh, Like this, there we go. Okay, so this is the bottom, this is the bottom bird in the picture. Um, show you the drill field if my camera will focus without any glare. Um, to me, let me have a look with my glasses on. Uh, yeah, the the symbols look okay. Uh, again, there's a bit of a crease here, but the glue follows the crease. It's not like across it, so that's fine. Just stretch the canvas out a bit when I put this down. There we go. That's okay. I like that. This is one of my bigger canvases. I haven't I haven't really gone bigger than thirty by forty up to now, I think. Um, and this is a 40 by 50 uh, so I think it's probably my largest or one of my largest can't remember uh, right. uh, okay so that's that one. 
got a couple of others which we might as well go through as well. Yeah, that's good. Oh, a bit of a crease there. Let's see if I can pull that out. Docker, docker. Let's put that over there. So I go upstairs. Uh, check the canvas code. Did I? Cano two four nine three six. Yep. Cano two four nine. Right. Okay. So this K. This next one. Came on the 18th of March. Uh, see what's in this. Careful so not cut anything inside. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay, canvas. Rolls. Toolkit, small piece, round piece of wax, bent tweezers, pen, green boat. Um This is a 30 by 40, I find it in my book. That's uh, this one. Okay, so this is the, this is this one. It's from the Goang Tranquilla Shop store on AliExpress. It's the 30 by 40 full square, £8.62. Ordered on the 4th of March. Dispatched on the 6th of March. Received on the 18th of March. Uh, just give me a minute. Um, no, right, okay. Um, so this is, let me just write it on here. Is there a code that I can see going? I've started keeping the packaging for a short while just in case anything's wrong with them and you have to send a copy of the um, packaging uh, I'll put the code on there when I find it okay so this is a 30 by 40 Full square, I think I already said. And it's on a foam core. As you can see. And let's just see if I can get a... Come 
code off it. No code. That's weird. No canvas code. I'll have to label it. Right, I'll just let it relax there a minute. Uh, right, we've got an inventory sheet. We have some bags. A few, not many. These are the bigger size bags. Uh, put those over there, separate from those of us from yesterday. Okay, put that out of the way. Right, this is, uh, I'll do my usual. Fast forward it. Let's just count them up before I do that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25 colours. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 22, 4, 5. 25 colours. Okay, and no code to put on there. Um, I don't even know what name to give it because it's a bit of a... It's like looking up at the night sky through trees. Okay, so we'll spin on for this bit. Um, one point... Three nine. Is that how many bags we need? One point three nine. So I should have two bags of one five four, which I have. Because we need two hundred and fifty. Okay. A weird way of doing it. These bags. These are really thin. The plastic on these are really thin and. Flimsy. I hope it. I mean, I haven't had any bead spillage, she says. There's one there. Um, but I bet they rip easily. Three, eight, four, six. 2.71, and I've got three bags. Um, three, five, eight, I think. No. Nine, five, eight. Nine, five, eight. One point four four. And I've got two. Oh, really horrible bags, these. Nine, eight, six. Nine, five, eight. Six. Nope. I haven't got nine, eight, six. Nine, nine, eight, six. Nine, nine, six, six. Nine, six, six. Nine, nine, six. Oh my God. Nine, nine, six. Jesus. That's difficult to read. Two, four, six. Nine, nine, six. I've got six. So it can't be nine, nine, six. Because I only need a three for that. It definitely says nine nine six. Right, would you say that says nine nine six? You can't even see it, can you? Put it on a white background. Does that say nine nine six? Nine nine six or nine six six. Can't be either. I haven't got nine six six. It must be nine nine six, but I've got six of them and I only need three. I'm just gonna put that on one side for now. Uh nine three nine, two, four, six, eight, 
10, 12, 14. Okay, so I've done the inventory and I've got these three that I've got queries on because, all right, doggy, I'm not getting up, good girl. Um, nine, I think this says 9.30. The writing on these bags is really bad. It's faded um, and even those that aren't faded are really difficult to read. Um, like I say, the bags are really thin. I think this is 9.30, um, which is here, uh, 9.30, there, as you can see it says I should have like three bags maybe four to give me a little bit of extra one two three four I've got five if that is 9 30 I mean I ticked it before I realized you know how much uh, I need 500 yeah so three bags should be enough but I've got five fine um the only one that's missing is nine eight nine nine six on the list nine nine six on the list uh, which again says that i should have three bags because it only needs 408 Yeah, two bags would be 400 plus an extra bag. But again, I've got three, six. I mean, I'm not complaining that I've got extra. It's just a bit confusing. And then, right, that's that, that's that. I've got 791 extra which isn't on my list oh that's not for my other B that's not for my other painting is it is it 791 that I need that I was short on on that other painting this is a different shot Oh, it was this. Ah, right, right, right. Okay, so if you've seen my unboxing of that one, um, these are the beads for that I was short for this one because they only sent me five packets when I needed six. They sent me another five packets, but... That means that I've got now got enough. So let me find that uh, packet of beads. Not that one. It's this one. Right. Beads. It's 
so oh, when did this arrive 18th um, missing beads arrived 18.3 okay so I can put those in there uh, good 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 right so that's sorted that stick them in there cool cool beans cool beans right stick those back in here this one right okay cool that explains where the extra drills came from then okie dokie so let's have a look at the canvas oh I need to put these away first don't I? um what am I going to call it because there's no canvas code um right I don't speak Ch uh sorry the recording finished then um camera ran out of space so I've just had to sort that out right what I was saying before I was rudely interrupted was this didn't have a name this canvas um but I've done this before where I've used the um Google Translate app on my phone um, to look at the Chinese writing on these um, inventory sheets I don't know if I'll be able to show you it's a bit awkward um, if you point at the text hang on where's my thing <laughs> sorry not doing it is it hang on let me get up behind the camera and see if I can do it that way not the easiest thing to do upsetting the doggy right let's try this without knocking the camera over okay so I know it's called the star because I did this when the camera stopped. Uh, there, can you see it says the star? Hey! Yo, for Google Apps. Um, so yeah, that's what I've started doing. Uh, and because Oh dear lord, not having much luck today. Get this canvas out. Well, because the um, only identifier on this canvas is the thumbnail, now I know the name of it. I've put the name on a little sticker and stuck it on the top of my canvas because I store my drills and canvases separate so sorry about plastic noise just need to put these drills away and then we can have a look at the canvas Um, now these are cheap packaging, like I say these bags feel really horrible and flimsy, the writing on them is rubbish, um, 
but when I got in touch with the company about the missing drills from that other kit um, they responded quickly um, they agreed to send the drills um, asked if I'd made another order so that they could include them which I hadn't done at that time um, but I did have an item in my basket from them that I wanted I had this in my basket that I was intending to order anyway so I decided I might as well order that and get the drills to come with it um, thinking that there was less chance of them getting lost if they were with other things rather than just being on their own uh, so that's those drills so, alright dog don't panic don't panic what time is it uh, it's gone half past uh, it's gone nine o'clock it's nearly half nine at night she usually has her supper at nine o'clock so she's here reminding me that I'm late giving her a supper so we'll just have a quick look at this um, uh, canvas. Uh, so look, this is the thirty by forty, and the blooming stickers come off. God damn it! it Will work if I stick it on top of on the top of the canvas. Stick it that way. And another one that I stuck on another canvas stayed on. Put it there. This stuff is obviously made so that it's shiny and it doesn't adhere to things. So, right. Let's have a look at the. Uh, drill field okay it's got a complete cover so I need to be careful oh there's some Chinese writing there that might be a code unless that just says the star again that might just say the star again actually let's have a look at this symbols yeah that's the canvas name it's not a code uh, so it looks nice you know what the canvas is almost faultless there's a little bit of a crease I think here ish um, but other than that Here's your reminder. Take tablets. Oh, I need to take my tablets <laughs> She'll remind me again. Um, a little bit of a blemish there. Take Just a little bit of a crease. But apart from that, the canvas is really nice. Um, the drill field looks okay. Um... Yeah, looks good. Uh, let's just put that over there. And I'll try and pull it flat or squash it down. Nice. Let's go for the other side. There is quite a lot of glue outside the drill field, unfortunately. Um, I have to use one of my thicker tapes for that. Uh, but that's nice. I think you can more or less see the image there. Um, again, there's a bit of a crease here. I'm not sure why. Because it wasn't taped like in the middle it's like in the middle but there was no tape there was no band 
I'm not sure why that's like that, but it's nothing to worry about. I really like that. It's going to be nice. Right. Okay, so that's that, that's the star. £8.62 that was from the Goang Tranquilla Shop Star Full Square, 25 colours, 30 by 40. Okay, don't slip down into the floor. Um, I do have another one which I might as well do now and then I'll sort the dog out. Again this came on the 18th of March. Uh, not sure what this is. Oh, I love this. Right, I've got a, an inventory sheet. Um, so this is, uh, where is it? Not that. Look at that. Isn't that Brill? It's a unicorn with the space behind it. I thought it was really nice. Really like that. This is from AliExpress Full Kang Official Store. £9.88 for a 30 by 40 round full. Uh, and this was received on the 18th of the 3rd. Ordered on the 2nd, dispatched 5 days later and it arrived on the 18th, so 11 days from dispatch, 16 days from order. Um, got an elastic band on it. Um, now this does have a code, Y08287, I don't know what that code is, Y08287. 287. Should we see if it's called something? Uh, it might might get upset with the plastic. Let's have a look. Colour. 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 What? Horse colour. It's called. It's not even a horse. Right, so that's not a very inspired um, canvas name, is it? Horse colour. We won't call it that. We'll just stick with the... Um, stick with the code. Y08287. 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 Full Kang official store. Yep, right. As long as there's nothing wrong with them, I don't need to worry about keeping that, but. Uh, okay, so tweezers, wax, pen, some bags. Take them out because I'll put them with my spare drills. Because I'm using little bags for my spare drills at the moment. That's the bigger bags. That can go there. Stick this back. Oh, these are real, really cheap, cheap tweezers. Oh, look at how thin they are. Uh, where are my others like this? Okay, these are the ones that I use at the moment. Look at the difference in thickness. <laughs> these are like 
twice as thick as these lol uh, don't matter it's like not what I'm going to use them anyway because I've got plenty uh, right. however if it's your first kit and that's the quality that you get it's a bit disappointing really right let's release this from its tape so that it can relax a little bit um, oh my god there's loads of tape Oh dear, I'm going to cut it. Um, I can find my... Where's my knife? Where's my knife? There it is. <laughs> Try and gently open this. Without cutting my the canvas or killing myself. Always. Do it going away from you, folks. Safety first. There we go. Okay, so... And just release that out a bit. It's on a foam ro roller. Let's let that relax. Relax. Right. Inventory time. So I've got an inventory sheet that's nice. For my horse colour. Okay, so this is not sure how many colours. Oh, I've actually got a colour count, which is nice. 38. It is colourful, isn't it? 38 colour. Okay. Oh, no. Stuck. Right. Bosh. Bosh, bosh, bosh. Right. Again, I'll spin on. Um, oh, this this has got gold writing. The plastic's not as flimsy as that last one. Still quite thin. Three, eight, three, one. Two. Correct. Three, eight, three, four. Okay, so there's a couple of anomalies and um, you might have seen me fiddling about during the um, inventory because one of the packets, I've lost it now, one of the packets was split open so I had to put it into a, I had to put it into a little baggie, but 
everything's here. However, I've got 208 and 333. Um, 208 says I need 810 beads and I should have five packets which give me a thousand so it would be 190 extra but 208, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 bags so they've given me 1200 even though I only need 810 which you know that's good but with 333 again five bags I need more, I need 42 more than the 208, but they've only given me five bags, so I've got less of a buffer, so I don't know what they're thinking was there, but anyway, everything's here, uh, now I've just noticed on here it says, Note, drill number 310-3865-5200. Three colours have big bag. No, they don't. Um, in my case, this is obviously generic. One small bag is 200 pieces. One big bag, 1,000 pieces, equals five small bags. But I haven't got any big bags. Anyway, that's the inventory. Everything's here. Um, right, let's chuck all these back in here in the most scruffiest way because the dog's getting really antsy because I'm nearly an hour late with her supper. <sighs> she was late with her tea though because I had to go to the doctor, so and I had to wait. Even though I had an appointment, because you know, what's the point of appointments? And they're going to make you wait anyway. Anyway, right. So, does this have a code? Yes, it does. Right. So that's the drills. Drills dealt with Pixie. Whoop. Avalanche. Right. Let's have a quick look at the um, canvas. Okay. So, canvas. Don't be looking at me cross. I'll be with you in a minute. Uh, right, let's take off some tape. I've seen other YouTubers complain about this yellow tape, that it smells, but it's like, well, it's tape. Don't worry about it. <laughs> uh, it actually peels off quite easily, but that's because of the nature of this cover. Uh, ah, I'll get the other lot in a minute, off the other side. Right, right, let's have a look. So the cover sheet is in one piece, yay. Uh, what have I got? A 30 by 40. Um, since I'm now a little bit more of an experienced, <laughs> she says, experienced um, diamond painter, I've started going for canvases that are a minimum of 30 by 40 um, especially since my new frog debacle which still isn't resolved those canvases were crap uh, right okie dokie let's have a look here uh, So, 
so this is which part of it is this must be the top because the things there isn't it um, so this is the horn you can't really tell but that's the unicorn horn best I can do try and get the glare off picture sideways on but let me show you the drill field uh, it looks nice the symbols all look clear yeah it's good I've got a post review coming out um, I've got three maybe four completed canvases to do reviews on now they're finished so that'll be coming out in the next few days probably uh, and let's just open up this side just to finish off the straightening out Effort. There we go. So that's the bottom of the picture. There's the. Uh, well, that's it. More or less from top to bottom. Okay. Good damn, get off, get off. Right. There we go. I think that's everything I've got at the moment. I keep saying I'm going to stop buying these right because honestly it's ridiculous but I've still got let's have a look in my book have a look in my book look in my book what's well, not arrived yet uh, so all those have arrived yet so I've got one, two, three, four, five. I think I've still got six, at least six, still to arrive. And that's me stopping buying them. Lol. Anyway, thank you very much for your company. Um, sorry about the mess up before uh, with my camera running out of space. Um, why didn't I have any tape up this side? Oh, that was inside near the foam roller, wasn't it? Der. Um, yeah. Sorry if it's a bit long. It went on a little bit longer than I intended, but these things tend to do that. Um, so I'll see you next time for what will probably be, like I said, a post review. Thank you very much for joining. Um, <laughs> I can't do it. Leave a thumbs up. Is that a thumbs down to you? Thumbs up. Um, if you enjoyed the video, subscribe if you haven't already. And if you've got anything to say, any comments, um, please leave a comment in the in the section down below. Thanks again. Bye.